All right, my last thing to cover. Um, look, uh, I had a source tell me. I know we've been doing a lot on Harrison Mooney, and I'm going to promise in the future, uh, and I've been promising this for years, that we're going to do less with Puck Daddy as far as fight with them. Look, it didn't work. It, it, was, it was a bit the whole long. I don't hate Greg. I don't really hate any. Well, I hate Ryan. Yeah, I hate Greg, too. But, I mean, uh, for, for Reese, like, I didn't start hating Puck Daddy. I did it just because I'm a publicity whore, and I need attention, like Jake Link says. Jake, I just noticed your glasses, and they're funny. We're just, I think we're just going to gloss over the fact that you have ridiculous fucking headphones and glasses. It's just too yeah, funny. Yeah, those on the last time. <laughs> I, I know, but it's... The glasses I just got yesterday. It's like a joke yeah, grenade, Jeff. It just, like, fucking hit me in the head. It's like, holy shit, you know? This is going to be my look. This is going to be my uh, my look for now on. Uh, why don't you get a scarf, you fucking hipster? You yeah. Know? <laughs> All right, wow. listen to me. Um, look, I got a source on Harrison Mooney that changes a lot of things that I said. I still support him, and I still forgive him, and uh, I do. Uh, but I have a source, and I like to see Harrison refute this. Uh, I hope, <laughs> I, I, I hope he can. Um, and this is not, this is not the, the, the source that told me that Greg Wyshynski goes around the D.C. area and tells kids there's no such thing as Santa, Santa Claus. It's not the same source. <laughs> it is not Free the same source yeah. that, told, that, that, that told me... The reason Ryan Lampert spends all day in his house is because he has bleeding, bleeding herpes, genital herpes all over his body. I mean, I, that's not the same source. Uh, this source has told me, and it's like a legit source, I'm not even joking around, that this is not the first time Harrison Mooney got caught. Um, I don't think I told you this, Jake. I think I told Jeff. Uh, yeah. This is not the first time Harrison got caught um, so-called harassing women. Now, I only saw half of those tweet so I, I i i fail to see the harassment in there but harrison has come clean about the uh harassment um he looks like he was hitting on chicks to me but you know, look i wasn't there and uh i'm gonna actually defend greg wachinski because i do trust this source i'm not even joking so you know it's true uh greg has actually according to the source covered for him in the past hmm. so i think we're gonna i think we're gonna leave that be that does not mean oh that does not mean – no, I'm serious. I'm actually serious, Jake. That does not mean we don't forgive Harrison. Everybody makes mistakes. I hope he learned from it, and I think he did. I, I, I read his um, Tumblr apology, and it looked really sincere to me. Did you think, it re did you think the Tumblr apology was sincere, sweetheart? What? The, the, the Harrison Mooney apology. Did you find it sincere when I read it to you? I told you what I thought about it. What would you think about it? It involved a lawyer. Oh, see, see Andy thinks that, um, that a lawyer told him to say that. Probably. I mean, yeah, but I would doubt it. Picture. I don't see. I don't. Here's why I don't buy that. Because the girl that exposed him over in San Jose, um, it, she writes this article. You might know me. I'm the uh, the person that exposed Harrison Mo Mooney. And I'll tell you, I'll give you every paragraph after that. Me, 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 me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I'm here. Me, 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 me. So I really didn't really buy her story. So if she was being sexually harassed. First of all, I only saw one tweet. Second of all, I don't buy it because it's all about you, apparently. So, but it, 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 if that's the case, look, we forgive Harrison because we, everybody makes mistakes. We wish him the best. I like, do you like his articles, Jake? I do. I do. It was very entertaining. He, he wasn't was really like, good. you know, he, he wasn't condescending. Like, he's not condescending like Ryan Lampert or you know Craig what, though, or I missed, I missed, he is, he is. And I missed, you know what? A lot of it wasn't directed towards us. And I, I've seen it. <laughs> well, like, Barstool Sports, it was directed towards. He is, he is, I saw more of it after the interview. He is a bit condescending. Um, but, it's funny, you know, what, like, I, I know it's just coincidence, but mm -hmm. the, uh, the, the post, the video that came out right after he, uh, he yeah. did our show. <laughs> uh, well, yeah. And then, the, but see, you know, I look, so I kind of sympathize because I have a little idea what it, it feels like to have to apologize when you did something wrong, you know, and I had to do that here. As everybody knows, if you want to go back and check the uh, um, the flashbacks, which I put it on a on a playlist. I did apologize to Ryan. I was way out of fucking line. Um, uh, of course, Ryan did not accept my apology. Thought it was insincere. And I got to be honest with you, that made me feel shittier than um, having done it. Because, like, I mean, to me, it was always ball busting between Mark, me and Ryan. After that, it got personal because I really did mean it. Uh, I, yeah, I, I really do hate the guy now because he didn't he didn't take my word as a man, you know. So, um, yeah, I, 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 yeah, it, it, it's funny you say that. So for that reason alone, I, I, I care about Harrison. He gave us one of our best shows. Would you agree, Jeff, Jake? 
Yeah, yeah definitely. Uh, he, he was really, really, really honest. Uh, he did not pull any punches. And he didn't – he didn't – he wasn't kind of sending to us at all. I, I, I just – No, it was it. really Basically, entertaining. I mean, he was really good. So whatever I, – I look, I know this looks like – and it was – and I, I got to be honest with you, Harrison, it initially was. This was – I wanted you on the air to promote my show. But I got to be honest with you, I don't care if you come on or not anymore – um, I, I just, uh, I just want to let you know that, 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 that Jake and me, and maybe Jeff, if you want to throw in, if you want, we, we support you and we really wish the best to you in the future. And we hope things work out. You know, I know you fucked up, but mm. I fucked up. Everyone uh, does. Jake's fucked up before and Jeff's probably going to fuck up one day and get fired. Probably. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so that's relieved. I don't know. If that's the source of my source reports. Karis, you want to come out and deny it? That's fine with me. Um, hey, if you want to go on and throw fucking uh, 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 those two, uh, your, your buddies under the bus, that's fine with me too. But <laughs> what's more important is that, that everything's okay with you, and and uh, you know I'm glad it was just Puck Daddy. And it works All right, and that leads us. <laughs>